Hi everyone and welcome to the 101 Earth Observation Virtual Lecture Series. This series is delivered by the satellite applications Catapult in partnership with Wild Labs. My name is Christian and I will guide you through a journey through Earth Observation. So this, this series of lecture is composed of different parts. The first part, uh, it's all about how remote sensing or Earth observation work, and this is also called the physical framework. This series is composed of different videos, different short videos, and we see here how those videos are actually named. We will see, for example, a first introduction of, of remote sensing, followed by a more theoretical view of electromagnetic radiation principle. And finally, we will have a look at basic properties of Earth observation imagery. The second part of our series is about what remote sensing can do. So we will see several application examples. We will have three different videos. So first, an overview. Of, of applications, then we will go much more in detail into passive remote sensing and active remote sensing. The third part of our series is about how remote sensing is being used. We will see specifically two case studies. We will see an environmental remote sensing case study about the search for lithium in, in, in the UK, in the region called Cornwall, and the conservation remote sensing study about wildlife corridors. Finally, the last part of our series is how do I actually get started? So once we get like all this information about remote sensing and earth observation, where do I get data? Where do I process data? We will see this in five different short videos, which will cover public mission and data. We will see specifically Sentinel and Landsat missions. And then we will, we will also have a look out of Earth observation derived products, which are publicly available, followed by data access and processing. And finally, we will have a look at the commercial world.